welcome back to Pure Power Panda. Today it is time for another smoothie recipe and I will show you how you can make a very delicious Christmas smoothie. These are all of the ingredients you will need for the Christmas smoothie. Here I have some soy milk. This one is with vanilla taste but you could also use just regular soy milk. Then I have some maca powder here, some hazelnuts, goji berries that I've soaked in some water, some cinnamon, maple syrup, here I have some marzipan, and also some gingerbread spice. And I also prepared one banana that I put in the freezer just for an hour so it's frozen. Alright, time to get started. I'm starting with the soy milk and I'm filling up my blender to about 250 milliliters, which is probably around uh, one cup, I think. But I'm gonna put all of the measurements in the description box later. Now I'm gonna take a spoon of the maca powder, but I'm only taking about this much, it's just a little bit. It's high in protein and it also gives you a lot of energy. This is why this smoothie is kind of like a protein smoothie because with the maca powder and also with the hazelnuts and the soy milk, you have a lot of protein in there. So this would be great after a workout or before. And I'm gonna take about one spoon as well. Put that in there. I'm taking my goji berries. I've drained them and just tossed them in there. Then I'm taking my cinnamon, my frozen banana, there we go. maple syrup. Now this is of course according to your taste. If you have a sweet tooth, you might want to have two spoons of it. Um, I think I'm just gonna start with one for now and see how I like it. Finally. I'm getting my marzipan. I'm just gonna take a chunk out of there, about this size, and I'm gonna break it up into tiny pieces. Oh, last ingredient, gingerbread spice. With this you have to be careful because if you add too much it's not gonna taste very nice. And I'm gonna take a knife and get like the tiniest amount. And now it's time to blend. And with any smoothie, the best way to blend it is always to start from very low speed and then gradually move up to high speed. There you go guys, this is the finished Christmas smoothie. Let's give it a try. Mm -hmm. It's delicious and I think the vanilla soy milk really gives it a special taste. You could also dress it up with a sugar cane. Doesn't that look nice? Thank you so much for watching guys. Um, all of the information for this smoothie will be in the description box and also on my blog which is purepowerpanda.blogspot.com Have a great holiday season and I'll see you next time. Bye guys!